guys, welcome back to Recipes Tested. My name is Brianna Robinson, and today I'm gonna to be making a spring vegetable gnocchi recipe. I got this off of Pinterest from the website deliciousknowledge.com. The link to the direct recipe will be in the bottom bar below. I usually make my own gnocchi at home. I just find it really fun to do, like the egg noodle recipe. You guys probably know if you've seen that, that I love doing that kind of thing at home. It's just a comforting thing for me to do. But I'm gonna go ahead and use a shortcut today with the package. So I hope that you guys enjoy seeing how this recipe turns out. And if you are curious, just keep watching and I'll get testing. To prepare this dish, I started by slicing up my shallot into nice slices and then just added it to my oiled pan. And then I seasoned it with salt and pepper and cut up my asparagus and a little tip to get the woody bits is just break off one end and then I cut those off and then cut them into one inch cubes nothing cubes one inch um, pieces I guess and did that in two separate things because it was a big batch and then I stirred it all together then added my gnocchi in and then it cooked pretty quick so once it floated to the top I went ahead and took them out in sections and then I cooked my asparagus until it was fork tender, so I tested that a couple times. Added my peas, cooked those through, added the gnocchi back in and stirred it in until it was all heated through. Added heavy cream, lemon juice, parmesan, and stirred it all together. Look how beautiful that is. Oh, I just can't get over how pretty this is. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and give this a taste now that it's all done. I did put some red pepper flakes on mine just because it was an option, so I wanted to give it a shot. Oh, this gnocchi is so big. Hmm. Wow, this is really good. Nice and simple, really good contrast in textures with the kind of pillowy gnocchi and the crunchy asparagus and the pop from the peas. Totally a winner. If you love vegetables, especially spring veggies. I feel like this time of year, especially it's great that veggies are always in season because after the heaviness of the fall and winter months, a nice fresh palette is exactly what I'm looking for at least. And so as far as a rating goes, I would rate this on like nine, nine and a half out of 10, really high up there. Kind of hits all the marks for me. It's really good. It uses seasonal ingredients when they're at their best and their most flavorful, which is a huge thing for me. I would make the gnocchi myself, like I said before, but if you are in a pinch, this is, this is really good. I have no problems with the prepared stuff. I just like making it. And it was really quick. It only took maybe 25, 30 minutes. And this is a great lunch or a dinner with like a side piece of chicken or anything like that. I really, really, really enjoyed this one. So I hope that you guys give this a try. Give me a thumbs up if you do, and let me know if you have any other requests down below. And don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.